Hi gamers, I'm Sarah Settler and today we're playing Space Engineers. So I want to give you guys an update of the Earth Base. Um, I call it Earth Base Alpha and yeah, I made some improvement to the base and also I built the ship uh, that will take me back to the moon. It's really a small ship. It has a little bit more than enough, I think, to um, get me to the moon. Uh, two hydrogen tanks and one oxygen tank. We have also 10 uh, small batteries. Yeah, and basically um, 16 small thrusters for RCS. And one big um, hydrogen thruster that I haven't built yet. So currently I'm um, loading um, hydrogen and oxygen to the to the ship, and the I'm doing that with a truck. So let's finish doing that. So for example, yeah, we we can control the the drill here, and let's um, take some ice to finish loading the 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 hydrogen so first we lower the drill the main drill well the yes the main rotor of the drill There we go. And we are going to point the drill in the right way and start digging. And it and what what I did is that I um upgraded the I upgraded the truck and I will show you I added um, a generator to it so now the the eye should be coming in yeah there we go let's keep also he has a piston so I can I can dig um, horizontally as well. There we go. Okay, when it does that, I think it's because it's um, having some trouble there. Right. Okay. So let's see how much eyes do we have now? Well, look at that. That's that's a lot already, and probably enough. Let's see. Let's lower a little bit more the, the drill, and then we can bring it back. Also, we can move it um, the other way, right? Like that. Well, it, it has several degrees of freedom, right? That will help us. There we go. So I think it's a lot of eyes already. Yeah, probably enough. Because otherwise I will be... And... Let's see what the... Um, tanks... Well, I think we're gonna look at the tanks here. So 
So there we go. We are now 50% filled. The oxygen tank is 100%. That's that's for sure. Okay, so I think we're almost there. 50% of the tanks are already full. So look what I did with a tank with a um, truck. First, I installed um, an engine at the front, hydrogen engine, to um, be able to quickly um, uh, recharge the batteries. And also, I installed uh, a generator here, you see. There is an hydrogen... A hydrogen uh, oxygen generator at the back and this this um, these blocks uh, this is from a mod they come in very useful they are very very useful because thanks to this mod I was able to connect the 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 drill the back drill uh, uh, through the piston through the rest connected to the rest of the truck so otherwise uh, it, it would be very difficult and also what i wanted to show you is that we have um, a refinery on the truck i find this uh, very useful to have the refinery on the truck because the truck mine so much ore right and with the refinery uh, in the truck it lets me uh, process that ore so i'm not that heavy i can convert directly the 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 ore to the ingots i need so i found that very useful okay and also uh, i replaced these uh, stairs here because when the truck is tilted it, it it's difficult to climb and I'm planning to uh, replace the other ones as well so that's um, that's the updates of the truck I think um, this uh, this truck is very useful uh, when you are established on a planet otherwise I um, I would use the um, the survival kit because the survival kit um, has the uh, the possibility to uh, craft components right so this this one with this configuration is not possible to craft components but once you are established and you have uh, an assembler like um, I have up here then you can um, go with this other configuration so let's see how much sixty one percent yeah it takes some time okay and the next thing we we have to do is to build um, we need to build the, the 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 thruster like the main thruster and this is what what is currently missing But for that I will need um, nickel because I don't have enough nickel to to build that. So, for example, um, let me show you the um, this would be the the big um, the large hydrogen thruster for the small. This one is for the small grid. So it require it requires 22 uh, metal grids. So this is what I'm missing now, the 22 metal grids. But in order to in order to build that, you see I need um, nickel. 
So if I if I have uh, 20, right, and I need uh, five of those, uh, and I need five um, per grid, then that would be 100 nickel. Uh, it's 22, so it's 110. And currently, um, I'm I'm afraid I don't have that much nickel. You see, I'm really low on nickel. Also, I, I don't have much iron either, so I will have to mine the, the mine some rocks And as you can see here, I've been doing that uh, Mining some rocks. I discovered some iron uh, some distance away. So that sped up things But to get nickel, I think I need um, to mine uh, some rocks and build them so that's the update guys um, it's a similar process to, to mine with a with a truck uh, well it's it's more convenient to mine like this um, this rock here that that this outcrop right because I don't have to dig down but um, I can dig o horizontally so that's that's a good thing and yeah uh, it this this truck is very useful uh, for uh, mining large quantities of, of uh, ore so I think then the, the next episode would be the the trip back home so stay tuned hope you like the video and see you in the next one this is Cyber Settler signing off.